Okay, I guess it started now. Okay, so just I'll remake the announcement then very briefly. We need everyone actually on Wednesday should have made the choice of careers. Um, but if you hadn't done it, uh, the joke made on Slack was if you hadn't done it yesterday, then you're going to be a cook. That's your choice of career. That's the default. Um, Gedidia and Benyam, Binyam were going to be, uh, they already decided they were going to be cooks. One would be SpongeBob, one would be Squidward. For those of you who don't, who knows SpongeBob SquarePants. But honestly speaking, it's important to make that decision. Um, without that, I was actually just talking to somebody from batch three and uh, this person has not made that decision and it's been a year and a half and this person is still floating a little bit and uh, through a quick discussion the person was able to say okay i get it i'm going for data engineering this probably explains why uh, it hasn't been a fit so i have no doubt that everyone can make a can make their own way and can will find their way um, you've come to our program because you want to do it faster and making this decision this week will help you to do it faster. So I wouldn't worry about optimizing, maximizing, finding the perfect decision. As I said before, there is no perfect decision. You might get, it doesn't matter which track you choose, you might get a difficult boss, your project might get canceled, you might find an amazing set of colleagues in a totally different role. You can't control any of that. So please make your decision and reach out if you have any questions. That's all from my side. All right, thanks. Um... I think in addition to that, we just want to let you know that for the upcoming weeks, um, we're going to be doing more of building your um, application materials. So CV, LinkedIn, GitHub, Ten Academy Profile. So if you need like extra um, career support services, just let us know anything like your suggestions, ideas are welcomed. Um, I don't already kept like a question or like it takes on the channel so you can just like trade up your ideas. Um, I think other, another thing is this month will be on the um, odd player seat or odd seat player today. So please prepare questions for him. I think we can go on. So has this week been? Struggles, blockers, progress, um, preparation for final submissions. So let's hear it. Is going first today, Martin. As usual, please hear from you. All right. Uh, thank you. Thank you for that. Uh, so, yeah, the week has been uh, quite a week. Uh, there is so many things to carry out, and so many things to prepare for. So, uh, it's been quite a week. So, I've been working on the task. I had completed it on Thursday, but uh, just polishing up on it. Uh, and so what I'm trying to do um, right now, I just want to ensure that I'm able to complete the report, also work on the career report, uh, the final report that is, and uh, just get to do everything and be able to complete and submit in time. Uh, maybe the thing that I learned uh, yesterday is, uh, I was talking also to some other guy, uh, also, Try to talk out, talk with a machine learning engineer now who is uh, actually working uh, in the field and is working for uh, is working for a certain company. And so I was just conversing with him and trying to find out just basically uh, what's going on on the field and everything of that sort. So uh, he really uh, was requesting me to focus a lot uh, also on the non-technical side besides just the technical part so uh from that i just said that i think it's good i also share with the entire team that if you get an opportunity just like during the day try to like spend even one hour just focusing on the non-technical bit like polish up uh the github portfolios uh the linkedin portfolios and all those all those materials ensure the your resume as if you just start polishing up on them uh, because it becomes uh, even the message templates and everything so that it can become easy when uh, it reaches that process of uh, going through the uh, the interviews and all that it will you'll have a very easy time so that's what uh, I got to learn and uh, yeah I'm just continuing to learn as we continue yeah thank you Yeah, also, Martin, it's nice that you've also done like some sort of external research to see 
what it takes to also like get this job so like you said it's not just about the technical cap um, abilities you also have to polish up the non-technical side so i i hope that the um other trainees can learn from what you said also so thanks for sharing i don't know if you shared any blocker but i think biniam can speak I just, I just wanted to make a quick uh, contribution to what Martin said. I think it's what I hear from him, and I agree with this, is that it's both. You have to do both. You have to be technically strong, and you have to be able to communicate. And if you're not feeling confident, or you're not really ready to be writing with people, if you're not ready to speak, then you have to improve those skills, and you have to improve the technical skills. So I just want to emphasize or to um, agree with what Martin said. You have to do both. So interviews, and just I forgot to mention, our plan is once people's profiles and CVs are ready, we're aiming to get interviews started uh, in about two weeks. So we have our list of companies that we're going to be reaching out to. For those people whose uh, materials are ready, we're going to start sharing them with different companies. So maybe at Stuart Lee, say interviews will start in two weeks, but we'll start saying, yes, we think you're ready to share in about two weeks, and then we'll start sharing. Thanks for contributing, okay. Biniam, please go ahead. Okay, thank you. Good morning, everyone. Uh, uh, Martin, thanks for sharing that. Uh, uh, it's quite helpful. And of course, uh, Arun, uh, uh, that's uh, good news to hear. Uh, we were waiting for that uh, <laughs> all these uh, couple of months. So it's good to hear that it's finally coming. So, yeah. Uh, to give you an update on my progress, uh, I have managed to complete the task yesterday as well. I'm just uh, uh, organizing things and polishing things up, uh, making some uh, better comments and uh, documentation. Uh, other than that, I haven't faced any blockers uh, since uh, uh, Wednesday. So uh, that's where I stand right now. Yeah, other than that, I don't have anything else to add. Awesome. Awesome. Thanks for sharing. Sorry, um, just, just, just a request. Can we hear from someone who is not finished? I mean, it, if we hear this, it seems like everyone is just chilling. Is somebody struggling? There must be people who are struggling. Like, surely it's not just everyone is, like, totally relaxed. All right, here we go. <laughs> okay, you did, yeah. Please go ahead. Okay, good morning, everyone. Hello. Uh, I haven't finished the task. <laughs> I'm not yet done. Uh, I haven't been, <laughs> okay, I haven't been up on schedule until we say due to some other reasons, but I've started working on the task starting from uh, Wednesday and uh, I think I'm on track. I hope to finish it before the deadlines on tomorrow and I'm working on task two now on the control inference part and different, uh, different types of uh, graph graphing models for the casual inference for the specific uh, breast cancer uh, implementation and i'm also working on the non technical skills challenge as well on writing the final report for the career choice and i hope to finish up uh, everything before the deadline tomorrow and i guess i'm on the, uh, i hope i'm on i'm on schedule now and i will make it for tomorrow's deadline All right. Um, Rafa. Morning, everyone. Morning. It's good to know your internet is back. Yeah, it's hot uh, today, but I don't know if exactly it's going to be like. Uh, stable or if they are going to shut it down again. So it's just, yeah, kind of worrying stuff. And uh, yeah, I mean, so yesterday was a really tough one. And uh, about the updates regarding the task, I'm, I'm really far. I feel like I'm, I'm, I'm far. But as Benjamin and Martin just said that they are almost finished. So yeah, I've just been like 
I'm telling you now, I'm going to ask you a lot until I've finished too. Hopefully the internet will be like there. And yeah, I mean, since the interim, I didn't do anything further. And uh, yeah, I think that's my update for now. All right, thanks for sharing. I think you should just take your time. I know you have like um, internet challenge at the moment. So just do um, your best, like, what's the word now? Just put in the efforts to like attempt them. You don't have to like force yourself to like do everything. I think effort is more important if any other thing. Yeah. So I think Malti, that your hands are up. Good morning, yeah, everyone. Out. Hello? Hello, can you hear me? Yes, I can. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. So, um, I was doing well. I was going well with the project until about 30 minutes ago when my PC just shut down and it's no longer working. I don't know what's wrong. I'm still trying to find um to find a way to revive it back. Um I'm hoping that I will be able to do that soon. And be able to finish my project and do the report. So that's the major stressful blocker that I am facing right now because it was so unexpected. But I'm still hopeful. And that's where I'm at. I managed to um Yes, get started on task two, um, but I haven't gone that far. I didn't face any technical blockers. It's just uh, the PC shutting down. Yes, that's my problem. Thank you. Uh, Martina, sorry to hear about your PC. I don't know if um, anyone has like a go-to tip to help with that. I hope you're able to fix it before the day runs out so you can get back to your tax. Yeah. So there are no hands up. I, I thought I saw Daisy hands up. Yeah, Daisy, you have the floor. Hi, Maria. My hand wasn't up, but I guess it was time. Um, uh, I'm doing well about my progress. I had a bit of a power outage blocker yesterday, but I was able to um, start out on task two. I haven't made um, very significant progress on the SEM, but hopefully I'll be able to cover that today along with um, the submissions I do tomorrow. Yes, thank you. All right, thanks for sharing. Samuel, please go ahead. Okay, hello everyone. Good morning, uh, Miriam. Um, to give you an update from my side, uh, there's no blocks until now. Uh, I haven't finished task two, but I am looking forward to finishing it today. And uh, the resource that's been posted on Slack, especially by Biniam, was very helpful. Thank you for that. And I guess that's it for me. Okay. Awesome. Thanks for sharing. I think that's why I can go next. Okay. Hello, everyone. Can you guys hear me? Yes, we can. Okay. Uh, good morning, everyone. Uh, so uh, I didn't do much yesterday. I was not able to do uh, because of the personal stuff. Uh, so, uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to uh, today's progress and uh, I hope I, I do well. I have a good understanding of what is expected and what I should do, so I don't think it will be that much hard. So yeah, that's my updates for yesterday. All right, good luck with um, the rest of Salam, please go ahead. Okay, uh, <clears throat> good morning everyone. Uh, well, for my progress, uh, I'm already I'm doing task two and I believe I'm going to finish task two by today. And for the blockers part, the only broker I had was uh, a very slow internet connection. It was difficult for me. I, I struggled a bit to uh, install some packages at first, but 
uh, on time I fixed that and uh, I think I'm going to finish task 2 by today and I'll start working on the report in the then and technical tasks later on. All right, thanks for sharing. Good luck with that too. Kadesa, please go ahead. Hello, good morning. Can you hear me? Yes, I can. Good morning. Okay. Thank you. Uh, actually, from my side, uh, I'm doing on some of the casual learning issues. And uh, yesterday, I did on <coughs> on accessing the data that we have given on doing some of the stability of uh, causal graph uh, normalization of that data and even uh, I, I have tried the jacquard similarity issues but uh, as a problem as a blocker uh, I, I need to reduce uh, the graph since the the bison has many nodes I need to reduce to uh, Markov model, but uh, unfortunately I can't because of some of uh, the Bison, Bison network er errors, which is uh, on my machine. I am using Windows, but uh, the module uh, Causal Net Utils Network Utils is not uh, installed for me. Uh, I'm doing that one. After uh, installing that one, I will do the uh, for the selected feature i will train the mission and i will predict do prediction on some of it so i miss two pointers uh, the last two points of the task two so i will try to finalize it by today and i will to i will uh, look at to the non-technical care issues also so that's my update from my side and uh, I will contact on Slack some of the trainees regarding the team, my blog. So thank you. All right, thanks for sharing. So just to like emphasize on what you said, you can easily like reach out to your colleagues, your tutors on Slack, especially the community building um, channel, just like ask for help, assistance, and I'm sure everyone is ready to help. So good luck with the rest of your tax. Um, there are no hands up, so I guess I will go through the list. Kevin, can we hear from you? Hello. Hello, can you hear me?
Hello and good morning. I hope you can hear me clearly. I just typed in the chat about my issue. Uh, yesterday I had some family issues resulting to to had unproductive day, but I have tried to watch some videos regarding casual inference and I hope to help me to tackle task two. I'm planning to do task two today and to finish all the tasks moving forward. Guys, can you hear me? Looks like uh, Marianne has gone. Just type yes if you can hear me. All right. So, why not move to the next person like sharing? Thank you, Shaka Kevin. So, understand you having brokers and also family issues. I hope that it's not too, too bad. Uh, that you're going to manage to yeah to finalize what you're working on for the week eight. So let's hear from other people as we are waiting for Mariam to just come back. Okay, because we can can hear from just yes, Harry. Hi, uh, good morning. Um, my connection is better, so Mariam asked for me to take over. She's going to rejoin soon, if that's okay with you. All right. Um, okay, I only joined recently, so I'm not sure who has spoken yet? Uh, Biruk, good morning. Have you spoken? Okay, I'm not sure if he can speak. Um, okay, I see you are unmuted. Um, Biruk, um, you are not speaking. Uh, Dagmawi, good morning. Hello, hello, Kerry. Hi. Okay, so speaking about my progress, uh, uh last uh, yesterday i was working on task two which was casual learning and uh, i'm uh, optimistic about it and uh, very positive to finish it uh, today and uh, to start working on my on my report so uh that's it and uh, uh talking about the blockers uh, still i haven't faced any blockers and that's it yeah Okay, great. That is good to hear. Thank you for sharing. Um, Daisy, have you shared yet? Um, yes, I have. I know Martin has shared. Thank you, Daisy. Uh, Miron, have you shared? No, I haven't. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Yeah. Uh, uh, so basically, my progress so far is I've been working on task two. Uh, I've been reading up a lot and looking through the materials shared on Slack. They have been really helpful. So hopefully, I will be I will be able to complete all the task two, and then I'll get started on the report and also the career finance submission, which is due tomorrow. So that's. So far, my progress, I haven't faced any major blockers so far. 
Okay, thank you. Um, I'm glad to hear that you have been doing okay. Um, Nahom, have you shared? Okay, good morning, everyone. Uh, so yesterday I was working on task two. Uh, I didn't manage to finish it, so I'll do that today. But I was facing one blocker yesterday when installing causal nix. Uh, I hope I'll solve that today or reach out to one of the trainees. Yeah, that's my update. Okay, thank you. And yes, please reach out to someone who can help you so that you can get it sorted as soon as possible. Okay. Nardos, good morning. Have you shared yet? Okay, I'm not sure. Good morning, can you hear me? Good morning. Uh, yes. Okay. So yesterday I haven't been able to get any work done. I have some personal issues that I need to sort out. But I'm back today and I'm ready to get back to work. Okay. Um, do you have a plan to catch up with the work that you missed out? Yes, I, I haven't started task two and I need to, after the stand up, I will reach out to one of my peers and I will start working on the tasks. Okay, good. Um, please do that as soon as possible. Um, and I hope you catch up soon. Thank you. Uh, Remit, good morning. Have you shared? I'm sorry, everyone. I've been dropping in and out of the school, so I'm not sure who has shared and who hasn't yet. So I'm just going down the list. Remit, have you shared? Okay, I'm not sure if she can speak. Uh, Samuel, have you shared? Um, Salam. Salam has shared. Um, Stella, have you shared? Okay, Stella is sharing in the chat. Um, Tesfaye, have you shared? Okay, I'm very sorry about this. And I think it is now time for the hot seat. And I'm hoping that Mariam has rejoined so that she can take over for that. Just give me a moment. Um, I believe that Desmond is the person who was supposed to be in the hot seat today. Can someone just put that, say it in the chat, confirm it for me? And he isn't here.
Mariam, have you rejoined? Yes, I have. Thanks for opening out. Has everyone spoken? I think so. I went down the list. It seems like most of everyone spoke before I got here. And I think it's hot seat time now. All right, that's awesome. Thank you once again. I think this one's on call already. Yeah. Um, good morning. I'm already on the call. Um, but um, I would love to put my video on. So just give me a minute to put my video on so that you can get it. Awesome. Thank you. Good morning. You would love to us. I'd love to put my video on. Sure, yeah, I think that's part of the rule that the players to show them their face. So guys, um, I think we're already familiar with the rules by now. If you have questions, please raise your hand and I'll set the timer. So when this one is ready, we just carry on with our questions. So, Anne's, please. Okay, one and. Two and. I think we need at least seven to ten and. Is your tutor so you have every opportunity to probably ask him things you're curious about? So let's raise our hands, please. Okay, three, four, more hands, people. All right, awesome. We can see this one now. Five hands. Six, nice, 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 awesome. More hands, please. Eight hands now. Nine. Remember, you can ask him anything. It doesn't have to, it's not even supposed to be technical. So, this is an opportunity to know more things about your tutor. You can even probably ask him to send you money, self. So, it's part of it. So raise your hands. I didn't say that shower. <laughs> and so I'm about to set the timer. So five minutes, right? This one, I think you can unmute at this point. Okay. All right, morning. Welcome to the hot seats. Well, sorry, we don't have refreshments, but well, I hope you can manage. <laughs> All right. Okay. Are you ready? How do you feel? Uh, I'm ready. I feel um, uh, I'm charged for to answer the questions. Okay. We, we hope they come easy on you. <laughs> okay, fine. So I'll just go down the list, starting with Daisy. Please start now. You can ask your question. Okay. Hi, Desmond. When is your birthday? My birthday is 12th of January. Okay, Nados. Hi, Desmond. Can you tell me what you love about your work? What excites you about? 
what excites me about my work is that um, actually I love teaching people. So when I see them getting to understand, um, it gives me joy. I love that's mentoring fine. young people. Okay, Desmond, how are you? Um, what is your biggest accomplishment in life? Um, my biggest accomplishment in life is, uh, uh, I can say right now is uh, maybe working with Chen Academy. Uh, that's what I count as my biggest accomplishment. Hello. Okay, hello, Desmond. Uh, what do you do uh, on your spare time? What's your hobby? Uh, what I do on my free time is that I like going out to walk in nature. And some of the time I like also going to sleep. Okay, Desmond, uh, what do you not like about Tin Academy? What? Do you not like about Tin Academy? Um, what I don't like about Tin Academy is uh, um, sometimes the work can be overwhelming. So, yeah, that's it. Hello, Desmond. What type of food do you like? Uh, what, type of food, what type of food do you like? Um, the type of phone I like is iPhone. Uh, that is that's the latest iPhone. Now home. Okay, Desmond. What's the last song you played? What? The last song you played. Um, the last song I played was uh, Great Is Thy Faithfulness. Um, yeah. If you know that song. Amal. Hi, Desmond. What's one thing you wish for? I didn't get your question, Amal. What one thing you wish? What's your wish? Oh, my wish. Uh, one thing I've always wished for is to have a wonderful family. A wonderful what? A wonderful family. Oh, awesome. Nice. That go me. Uh, hi Desmond, uh, hi. how do you handle any kind of stress that you face? Um, okay, how I handle stress that I face is um, uh, when I realize that I have stress, I sit back first um, and I get some rest. Then I just take a long break. Uh, most of the time I like doing maybe by the water body so that I can chill and relax and cool. And then um, I get back if there are a lot of things that I have, um, I try and set up how I will try and handle it. If something, if it is something beyond my control, well, I just leave it. So, and then I'll, I also look for mentors and share it out. Um, I realize that by sharing it out, I get solutions. Um, also, uh, sharing is a way of also reducing how much you think about uh, the stress that you have. Okay, Desmond has less than 40 uh, seconds to go, so they see. Yeah, um, actually, I was, I have a question. So, what's your biggest fear? Oh, my biggest fear is um, uh, my biggest fear. Um, uh, my, my biggest fear is uh, if I miss the kingdom of God. That's my biggest fear. Okay, Biruk, Meron, Selam. Please ask your questions, although time is up. Hi, Desmond. So, what's your life principle? Uh, my my love, life principle is um, God first. And, um, yeah. 
uh, that's the goal. So I try and uh, apply everything that I do in a godly principle. Okay. Your favorite place? I didn't get your question, Meryl. What is your favorite place, Desmond? Oh, my favorite place to be? Yes. Um, okay. Uh, my favorite place to be, I would love to be in, uh, um, in Germany. Amsterdam. So that's my favorite place. And I've been longing to be there since childhood. Okay. And this man, what's the happiest day of your life? Um, Salam, I didn't get your question. Uh, what's the happiest day of your life? Um, the happiest day of uh, my life uh, was on I think it was on 14th of November. Um, yeah, that's the day I I got to start a new life somewhere. So I count it as one of uh, my happiest day in life. Wow, awesome. Amal, I think that's the last person that has the hand up. Or was she raising it from previously? Amal, are you there? Um, yeah. So, where do you see yourself 10 years from now? Oh, uh, where I see myself 10 years from now? Um, uh, well, 10 years from now, I think uh, um, in different aspects of seeing myself, uh, uh, maybe doing some missions work, and then also I would love to be a consultant 10 years uh, from now. So I would love to get off the track of employment and then uh, just become a, a consultant. Uh, um, maybe running my own farm and uh, also uh, be able to uh, employ one to three people in my farm uh, and um, yeah, also uh, becoming a family. So that's why I see myself in 10 years from now. Wow. So let's clap for this one. Thank you. How do you feel? You were able to answer 13 questions in a min in five minutes plus thereabouts. So I think you did great. Well done. Thanks. So everyone has chest for this one. Let's clap in. The comment section or the chat box. Thank you, thank you. So, before, before we leave you, I think my question is, without looking at your screen, how many, um, by five trainees can you mention like from the top of your head like don't look at your screen just keep mentioning them um i know nardos i know uh um machilda machiluta amal uh i know uh, rafa um salam um, Abel, um, uh, Nibidia, uh, um, uh, 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 yeah, the others would have to have time to think. Yes. 
I think you're doing great. <laughs> Should I? I think Matthew has a question for you. Well, well done. Okay. On this one, Tisha. I think Matthew has a question for you. Okay. Matilda? I'm sorry, Desmond, my mic had an issue. Um, so, who's your most favorite person and why? Um, my, my most favorite person is uh, my mom. Um, uh, and it's because uh, there are a lot of sh things that we, we share. Um, and uh, anytime that I just feel uh, I'm all over the place, I would call her and, um, yeah, uh, she, uh, all of the time, if problems feel quite overwhelming, she just tell me, come back home. So, yeah, when you're home, she's uh, funny enough, we laugh a lot, and, uh, yeah, that's why she's my favorite person. Very cute. Thanks for sharing. I think that's the end of this um that's the end of this segment. I don't know. So thanks for coming around this month. We appreciate. Um I don't know if anyone if anyone any has any other thing to say. But um that's the end of today's stand up too. So thanks for coming around guys. Um rest well. Um enjoy the rest of your weekend and don't forget to turn in your final submission and good luck with every other thing so take care guys see you around see you on slack okay goodbye Bye. Bye.